With the constant ongoing load shedding that is affecting all of us in South Africa, is it not time to get yourself an inverter? Now you may not need or be able to afford a fully off-grid solution with panels and the like. Perhaps your requirements are only to power a few basic essentials, such as lighting, the internet, TV, and possibly medical equipment. Lalela have a range of lithium-ion inverters, namely the LAL600WP fitted with either a 50 or a 60 amp hour battery, and the LAL600 Plus, which is supplied with an 80 amp hour battery. All of these batteries, incidentally, are lithium ions. All three of these inverters produce a pure sine wave form, and a pure sine wave inverter is at the top of the list of functionality, with the ability to run any and all equipment that is designed to work on a pure sine wave. This includes anything with a motor, fridges, freezers, appliances with digital clocks or timers, dimmable lights, newer TVs, laser printers, and medical equipment, such as CPAP machines and oxygen concentrators. Many inverters only produce a modified sine wave, which is not ideal for modern day electronics and any appliance with a motor. Another point to remember is that a pure sine wave inverter requires a bit of power to run itself. So your available power output in watts is often slightly reduced. It's a trade-off between available power and how clean or pure the power is. Now each of these inverters can only supply a limited maximum wattage output. And this needs to be thought through when selecting the inverter. You need to add up the total amount of watts that you want to use at the same time. And every appliance has a watt rating on it. This is also true for light bulbs. Add up your total wattage that you want to power. If it's below 600 watts, then the LAL 600 range or the 600 plus would be suitable. The difference here is the size of the battery. Speaking of batteries, I hear you ask, how long does it last? How long is the proverbial piece of string? What are you running? Now, some typical run times are 20 hours for a laptop, five hours for a TV and decoder or a desktop. Each model varies slightly and is load dependent. However, as these are lithium ion batteries, the charge time is much less than a lead acid battery. They're considerably lighter and smaller, but most importantly, these batteries have a lifespan of about 2000 charge cycles if discharged to 80%. That's a lot of charging and discharging compared to an old lead acid battery, which doesn't have nearly the amount of available cycles. Now, if you do have a lead acid battery in your inverter, and the battery is not lasting, Lalela does stock drop-in replacements for your inverter. And of course, these new batteries are lithium ions. It is better for the long run. So how do these work? These are really easy to use plug and play systems. There's no installation required. Plug your inverter into the main socket and the battery will charge when the power is on. On the outlet plug, plug in what you're needing to power and you may find that a multi-plug will allow you to plug in multiple devices. When the power turns off, the inverter seamlessly jumps into action and keeps your devices on. The only way you'll know the inverter is running is the hum of the cooling fan. Now, unfortunately, these inverters cannot power your geyser, stove, oven, pool pump, and so forth. The available power that it can supply is simply not high enough. Now, all Lalela products are available at major retailers and on takealot.com. And if you're a reseller, they're available through Tarsus. More information can be found online at www.lalelaretail.co.za. Get yourself a Lalela inverter. You won't be left in the dark.